going on everybody welcome back my name is adrian and today i'm playing subject 65. this is another game made by max horror youtuber extraordinaire and also creator of games such as what happened on the farm and the book they just released this game today and i enjoyed the other two that i played by this dev so much that i had to hop on this and if this amazing dance sequence at the front of this house isn't enough to get me into the game i don't know what else will be so let's play there were these rumors about this old psychiatric hospital a big building out in the middle of nowhere. I heard about some kind of experiments going on. Experiments on patients. I have tried to contact and get a hold of a doctor at the place. But they are of course always too busy to talk. I have decided to go check the place out. Well. Ooh. Oh, okay. I see you. I like when games do this. When they put the uh, tutorial kind of in the game world that's cool wants to move right mouse to zoom shift to barely run <laughs> well <laughs> at least you call it how it is that's great e to interact f for flashlight when you have it control c to crouch space to jump hey can you also tell me what to do when i hear strange noises in the wilderness beside me Ooh. Ooh. okay okay this is taking like a serious step up from the other two games that I played. It seems to be quite a bit more detailed. Uh, T to talk. Excuse me, but are you all right, lady? You should leave this place. I was here, but no more. She's probably a patient. I should find a doctor. Yeah, that's the rationalization I'm gonna come to. Yeah. All right, let's go maybe in here. And she's gone. <laughs> okay, I love it. Wait. See something flashing over there. A key, perhaps? Yo, this game has to chill. This game really has to chill. Aha, a key. Uh, uh, uh. Aha, main door key. So I'm assuming that's gonna be there, but I'm curious. Will I be able to, whoa. Oh. Coins. The sounds in this game, I gotta say. Concerning as hell. Oh, this is open. Should I be in here? Okay, that's locked. I'm definitely gonna have to... I'm definitely gonna have to get the hell out of here and never come back. All right, I'm gonna go to the main door. That's what's gonna happen. My main door is to go into and then act like I don't know nobody. You guys remember? Uh-huh. Relevant meme. Inside. Wait. Is that not the main door? Is this the main door? Staff only. Okay, I won't be able to go in there. So it now looks like I then only have one place to go and that's through here, so let's do it. I could have sworn that would have been the main door, but I guess not. This door seems fragile. I should find a tool to open it with. Oh, you got it. Oh, we got a little friend waiting for us in there. <laughs> All right, I guess I gotta go in here. I guess I don't have to go in there. Oh, wait. There's a key in one of these slots. Maybe I can find a coin somewhere. I know where coins are. Will it let me pick them up, though? That's the question. Oh, okay, so I think I was only able to pick one up, but that's all I need. Let's do this. Hell yeah, bro. Putting that in. Getting the key. And it just magically appears outside of the vending machine, no less. There we go. Thank you. I got the hallway key. Is this the hallway? I think it is. There we go. What up, man? Um... Now, I know you're having a bit of a rough time over there, but if you could maybe just stay where you are and not chase me and or eat me. Okay, it's gotten really real now. This is the only place I can go. I got a key. Very nice. I wish, I wish there was a flashlight in here. About Subject 65, after several weeks with isolation and special treatment, does not seem to have any positive effect on Subject 65. Subject 65 has become way too aggressive and it is hard for our staff to keep doing the treatments. We already lost one of our good doctors after a treatment conducted inside the cell of Subject 65. I recommend... I recommend that we terminate Subject 65 and move on to Subject 66 instead. Best regards, Dr. Alan Jones. Well, Dr. Alan Jones, I hope you're ready to die, which you probably already have. So you're way ahead of me in that respect. Um, so do I go back? Oh! Okay, 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 okay. That actually scared the crapazoid out of me. 
Ooh, I'm getting a little better at handling these jump scares, guys. Gotta admit. All right, let's pick the axe up. Now, let me guess. This is only gonna be used as a tool for one thing, and I'm not gonna be able to use it as a weapon. I got it! Holy crap, that was the most dramatic thing. Okay, what happened here? <laughs> well, I can explain exactly what happened here. So this person here was bringing in a pizza for everybody, for a little pizza party they wanted to have. But the problem was, they got it with mushrooms on it. And nobody likes mushrooms on their pizza. So everyone left, left the place in a complete state of disarray. And this person here decided to eat some of it on their own. Maybe had a little bit too much. Stood up and because of the, the displacement of the body weight due to all the pizza shoved into them, they dropped the pizza on the floor, the remaining slices, slipped on it, fell, cracked their head open, and that's why there, there's all this blood here. You thought I was gonna say it was all pizza sauce? <laughs> you, you fools! Fool. What? Oh, a big key. Key for the main building. Who's got a shaker in here? Not cool. Whoa. F. Aha! I feel powerful now, I'm not gonna lie. Alright, let's go to the main building. I'm pretty sure I've done everything I need to do here, unless... Can I maybe... Uh... I can. Ooh, this is definitely a place I'm gonna have to come back to, isn't it? Or can I go? Is this gonna be too early for me to do this? I gotta say, I don't wanna ruin the flow of the game, but I'm intrigued. There's somebody in there. <laughs> oh. Okay, what? What was the noise about? I gotcha, okay. Ooh, hey, haha. <laughs> Can I open you? No. What about this one? Anything useful in here? Flush mechanics, okay. Horror. It just says horror. Well, I'm definitely gonna need a key for that stall, which I'm probably gonna be able to find in the other room. So, the other building. So, let's go. I'm just gonna leave all the doors open, no problem, nothing to worry about. I'm going in, guys. I'm doing it. I'm digging this so far. Why do I only have three fingers again? Maybe one of my fingers is off camera. It's the only thing I can think. What does this say? Mutation. Subject 65 has been mutating due to the treatment and seems to be evolving into a hybrid between a man and a beast. The subject's teeth getting longer and sharper. His skin seems to be decaying and he is getting a lot stronger. I know you wanted us to keep him alive and keep the treatments going, but this is getting way too dangerous now. If we don't eliminate Subject 65 immediately, I fear for all of us. Please take this as a warning, Dr. Landau, and let us do the right thing. Regards, Dr. Alan Jones. Well, Dr. Landau seems like an absolute and utter jerk. Why? Oh my god, I feel like I shouldn't be able to go to some of these places that I'm going. Uh. Oh. Oh, that guy is jacked, my dude. How about I uh, leave him alone until I can find a key and free him and have him as part of my alliance to evade the monster. That's my goal here. No card. Okay, let's go down this area and see what I can do here. Can I go in? Wow. I feel like I have a lot of, oh my God. I have a lot of access in this place. Is there another jack dude in here? No, but. It seems like there is somebody in there, so. And it also seems like this place is not. Oh, okay. You've interrupted my train of thought with horrendous visuals and bass drops and all the dead bodies floating around the place. Uh, oh no. Oh no. Oh no, am I stuck? Am I stuck? I think I'm stuck. I think I have to restart the game. <laughs> Unless I can wiggle my way out of here. Dude, oh yes! Oh, I feel even more powerful now! Alright, I'm gonna go upstairs. It's the only thing I can think to do. I'm half expecting a jump scare at every turn, my, my guy, my man, my friends. Oh! A little secret entrance! I don't know why I decided to do that, but let's check this area out first. Ooh. Hey. Oh no, this must be where the treatments are done on the patients. Ooh, yeah, well, looks like you got what you deserved if you were doing some kind of horrible, horrible thing with them. Oh my god, okay. I didn't realize how many 
people are in here dead. Let's get out. I don't like it. I'm gone about here. Nope. Okay. There's only one way to go. So I'm going down it. Let's do this. Let's do this. What's in here? Uh, seems like some kind of storage. <laughs> That is my response to you. <laughs> Stop it. Oh, that's what happened. It was me. I'm the piece of shit. I knocked it down. Okay, I'm going in. That's unenterable. <gasps> Holy shit. Can I? Woo. <laughs> I thought I was going to have to run. I lo love the metal music that was playing there for a couple seconds. That was badass, dude. <laughs> I'm digging this so far. It's a little silly. And it's still coming through. Is that like from the Doom soundtrack? I don't know. I got the elevator key card. I'm getting the hell out of you. I don't want to deal with this no more. I am not the one, guys. You're I am not, not the guy, one. Pal, I'm jumping me. down these stairs, speed running my way to that elevator. And here I go. Access? Um, thank you? Where do I go? Which floor? What is happening? What? What happened? There's more? Wow, dude, Max Horror, you're not playing around this time. This is way more than I thought it was gonna be. I'm in. Wow, even more dead bodies. Okay, let's just, let's keep pushing away from that. I don't wanna end up with the same fate as that. Ooh, oh, oh. Do I have to run now? Is that what's, ooh. I need to find a way to escape? How would I do such a thing? Is there a vent I can crawl through? Can I go through the vent that they went through? <laughs> oh, wow. Just hide and use the entrance route as an escape. I managed to escape this hospital through the ventilation systems. I don't know what happened to that monster I left behind, but I finally got the police involved and the place has finally been shut down. I am glad I made it out alive and it's all finally over. Hell yeah, dude. That was actually pretty good. I mean, it's basically just like your typical run of the mill asylum horror game where you're kind of bouncing from room to room, finding keys, getting jump scared every once in a while. But one thing I really enjoy about this dev's games is the pacing of them. It flows so nicely from beginning to end. There aren't like any jarring moments that are confusing or annoying or anything. It's just a straight through horror experience. So I love finding games like this. If you're gonna make one of those like jump scare factory games where you're kind of bouncing from room to room looking for keys and whatnot, it's best to do it in this way, in my opinion. It just makes the whole experience feel cohesive and fun, like a nice straight through gameplay. Makes for a really nice gameplay. I got nothing but nice things to say about this. If you guys want to try this out for yourselves, I highly recommend it. I'll leave a link down below in the description for you. Anyway, that's going to be it for this video. Thanks everyone so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And I'm really appreciative of all of you who watch my videos and leave such lovely comments and show your support every single day on this channel. If you did happen to enjoy the video, make sure to hit that like button down below. Don't be afraid to leave me a comment. Let me know how you feel. Smack that subscribe button down below if you're new to the channel. And I can't wait to see you all in the next video. Take it easy.